guys, what's up? It's Pyro here, back for some more Fall Edge out there. Begin a lot of off stream work. It's just five minutes here, five minutes there. So I'll show you what I got. We got this guy here, Alex Edgar, who I sent out last night. You can see he has loads of goodies down there in his hotbar, which I am not going to collect. Oh yeah. Alex Edgar, let me check your special out. So it seems anything, uh, anything in strength he would specialize in. I can put him down there. I'll put him down there. I think we haven't got a full room down there. Um, I'll take you on a little tour of my BS. So up top, got the clinic. I got basically everyone in here with lab coats on and uh, intelligence increasing items. Gonna help a bunch there. Rather infestation. Okay, uh, you take that. They all have guns now, so we should be okay. Over here, I made a new diner because I was running low on food. This is a game room. It increases luck, so I've got Johnny Wilson in here. As you can see, his luck stats five. And I've got Jenny B in here, and their luck stats five. And the plan is to get these luck stats up to like nine, and then I'm gonna breed them like rabbits, because luck plays a really huge part in exploring their wasteland. Luck also plays a huge part on whether you'll feel or not when you rush. So I'm thinking of having, you know, a high luck person in each room, and then I can rush the hell out of most of these rooms and get extra caps and XP. Um, storage room, just for stuff. Uh, got the old two bar generator and the water treatment over there. A barracks. This is the strength training room. Again, I'm just training Edward Hill here up. He's on a four. And Cynthia Hawkins is on a four. Just train those guys up. Uh, down here we have a radio tower. I'm eventually going to merge these, but for now they're separate. Um, I've got like five, six people from them so far, so it's pretty good. Uh, again, I have 72 people in the vault, as you can see up top. This is armory this is our training perception so i have alexander here he's on five perception and i have peach phillips who's on five uh over here again another generator for par down here is a new room that we got recently it unlocked when i hit 70 dwellers it's a garden it's basically an operative version of the denner eventually i'd probably want to phase the denner out but for now until i get more caps and keeping it another water treatment down here because I was running low on water. If you run low on water, your water will become irradiated, which means you're going to have to use a lot of rataways. I like saving those for exploring, so I don't want to use them. We have a school. Increases intelligence here. I'm just, again, these guys are going to be the scientists, so they're going to produce rataways and uh, stim packs. And I think that's it, uh, which is good. I actually have a lunchbox you know, box here. My goal here is to get two clothing items and then I can get another lunchbox. So I'm kind of hoping I can grab two clothing items here. Okay, that's kind of crap. That's good. Give me a clothing item. Yes! Fantastic. Because then I unlock another lunchbox. I'll claim that. Equip six dwellers with an outfit. That is really simple actually because if we go down here for example any of you guys got an outfit on? Margaret Harris, I need to give you something that increases P. Uh, I'll give you that. Anything that increases Whistland Doctor, you can take that, sure. And the best thing is, you can actually just equip and then unequip. Really? For a lot of these guys. Uh, you've already got one. Has she got one? No, she has not. It's free caps, buddy. There we go. Even him, you know, like I can do this. I can switch him to his vault suit and then I can give him that back and that will count. So pretty good. Some free caps there. I got a lot of weapons now as well from Alex Edgar coming back. So stop 14 incidents. Unfortunately, we have no more lunch boxes, but I'm gonna unbox this one anyway. Hopefully we can get a, an elder or some sort of special citizen. That's garbage, garbage. That is actually, eh, that will be good later game. A lot of people ask me what's endurance for. There's a, a room you get later game called the Nuka Cola Bottler, which produces caps, and uh, you need good endurance. And also endurance helps in the wasteland. Our rare card is, oh, Vincent Hicks. Wow. Vincent, where are you, buddy? There he is there. Vincent Hicks, look at those specials, though. Six luck. The dude's a genius. He has seven intelligence. Get him in the lab now. Get him in that lab. I might up, up yeah, I might upgrade the clinic because uh, if I upgrade the clinic, then I can. I really am not really low on anything, so I'm gonna do that. 
these are the rooms I have. I have a lounge as well at this point. Nuclear reactor, garden. Water for purification is really close, but I want to get another med bay going, so... Put that there. There we go. And then we'll take him and film in there. Look at that, man. Look at those stats. I should really breed him with someone. Comedian outfit. Really good item there. So get you in there, Vincent. Have we got any pregnant ladies here who are really smart? Uh, intelligence is two. Intelligence is one. Your intelligence is two. Can I give you anything to increase your intelligence? Intelligence is one. That's pretty bad. Uh, frick, I don't think I have anything I can give you to increase your intelligence. I have some strength-related gear, though, if that's going to help. So we'll go to the nuclear reactor here. And give her that. That's going to be better for her. And leather armor. Is there any plus strength? A soldier uniform is probably going to help a little bit here as well. And I also want to start equipping most, if not all, people with guns because... I mean, I have a bunch of guns right now, and it's just for safety's sake. So since since this guy has really high luck, I want to assume that I'm not going to mess up as frequently. Also, when you increase your med bay, you increase the amount of stim packs you can hold. No one up in the top right. It says 34. I was locked to 25 previously, so it's really all about that. I rush if I'm under 50. Because it's just free XP. Okay, at field. Okay, if it's router riches, we're good. Alright, so this guy here. Give him like a beast weapon. That. And since he has a high luck stat, all of his hits are gonna have more chance of hitting. It's an RNG. So for example, the sort of shotgun has a rule between 6 and 7. Since he has a high luck stat, it's going to constantly roll 7 more so than 6, and that means we get higher damage, so it's probably better to give him that then. Let's go for that. Let's go for that again. I mean, it's, it's free, it's free, uh, syntax, you know? Really, really good. So, I don't know what my goal next is. I need to breed a little bit more, but you have a lot of pregnant ladies here, so... Uh just doing the job. I want to show you my Wasteland Explorers as well. Uh, I took a lot of suggestions last episode. No, she's returning the vault. I sent her out just to get one or two bits of equipment. Um, so she should be back soon. I'm going to send out someone more powerful. Look at this beast. Elder Lions. He's been out in the Wasteland for 18 hours. Still has 10 stim packs left. Look at all this loot he has. The beast. Uh, so he's going to keep going there. He has 2.6k caps. That's beastly. Um, I think once we get like 24 hours, we start encountering like death claws and stuff. But that's where you get the good stuff, like the the fat man and stuff. So I want to constantly keep him moving. Uh, we got Marie Scott again, high level, high stim packs and high rides. She got some good weapons already. Look at that tuned laser rifle. So I'm gonna keep her out for long. Uh, Leon Lyons or Lewis Lyons here. He was doing okay, but he ran into stim packs. Uh, so he's bringing a decent bit of loot back. And then recently I sent out. Emma Campbell. Emma has a huge luck stat uh, with the formula wear, so the luck stat actually increases the amount of drops you get, which is nice. She only need 9 artists in their journey, but you can see she has a lot of stuff already, so we're looking pretty good there. But yeah, as I said, I'm gonna just quickly bring my storage here, so got some good shot off shotguns, cool. Anything that I need to give out at this point, luck 3, charisma 3, uh, I guess the Republic groups get going in the radio tar. Are you one of the Republic groups? Well, you can take that, Larry. You take those. And let's see. A thousand. We have a thousand. What can we upgrade? I want to upgrade. Can I upgrade that? I'll do that. I'll do that. Uh, I'm getting quite big, but there's a long way to go here, so I want to max this out. Um, just thinking what I can do, though. I think as much I can do at this point. Nope. So I'll send it here, guys, and I'll see you maybe for a little more updates for today's episode, because I, I, I put one up earlier today, so I don't want to do a huge one. So yeah, bye. Yeah, what's up?
I was just grinding a lunchbox off screen doing some of these daily quests and uh, I got one. I'm also uh, trying to get this assign eight dwellers in the right room so there's actually I think there's a four way room you can do with a diner and I have to assign eight dwellers in that to do that challenge. I just like grinding through the challenges because you can get lots of free lunch boxes if you quickly do it so I need to uh, convert this uh, I need to get some coins so let's open this and see if we can get some okay pretty good pretty good carbo okay that'll do average but whatever 750 we didn't have 750 what's up power here back just for an update uh i got a new lunchbox from doing a quest why not open it? I want to open all my lunch boxes on camera I get from just grinding, so that's pretty good. It's pretty crap. Pretty crap. And garbage. Why am I getting such bad lunch boxes lately? I have no clue. So just a little update on my guys. Elder Lions is 2100 out. Uh, what else we got going here? Oops. I'll get this in a second. Uh, Star Palette and Cross Eye Santa with 25, uh, 25 stim packs and 18 Rataways. She's probably going to be going for a couple of days uh, at that rate. Elder Lion slowly running out of steam here. Only 21 hours in. He has 10 stim packs left, so he should be a while, but his Rataways is going to really bite him in the ass. Um, Murray Scott, she's doing okay. Uh, he's coming back. Lewis Lions. He has some pretty good loot. So I'll get him back tonight and then send someone out before I go. Uh, again. Emma Campbell's going to be going for a while as well. And I sent out uh, Natalie Murray with 25 25. I want to see how far she can make it. I actually gave her a sniper as well. So that should be interesting. The baby grew up. The baby grew up upon her. Oh yeah. I love, I love that. <laughs> So which baby grew up? Christina Hill. She seems to be charisma. So where is she? Is this her here? Yep. Christina Hill. Where can she go? She can go in there, I guess. I just need one more dweller in the right room, and then I've got that stupid challenge out of the way. Uh, let's see. If I do this, right? Does this count? If I do this, for example, her special is endurance. Okay. Uh, no, we have no endurance. Her special is endurance as well. Damn it! What about yours? What's yours? Luck. Yours is strength. Esteban Hill. See, that did not update it. I think it has to be a new dweller for, in order for me to get it. Huh. And then I just need to get a few more caps. Okay. So I'll get that one on the bottom overnight. Let me just do a little bit of a... Uh... Oops. A bit of rushing here. 24% not bad Thank you Failure What do we feel on? Router issues, well we all got weapons This shouldn't be too bad there I just need one more I think just one more seventy percent chance and I feel that bad luck she 
picked up some more armor, nice. Check this out. Uh, who was it? A while back, she got a tune laser rifle. Pretty good pickup in the wasteland. Don't usually see that until you're a bit further out. Uh, I guess we'll do this. 70% chance rate again. Well, 68. And there we go, that's that challenge done. 195 bottle caps, level up six dwellers. Well, that's pretty easy. One. I'm gonna start pouring it in a second, I can tell it. We're gonna conclude the episode today uh, with another vault tech lunchbox. Let's check it out, guys. I got this from uh, a daily quest I just did. That's pretty bad. That's pretty bad. That's okay. And we get. Oh! Wow! Gems! Gems! Really, really good pack there. So, you're probably noticing, dude, there's like freaking so many people outside. I sent these people outside myself, okay? I sent these people outside myself. So, let me just quickly rearrange them. The thing, I had a quest to send eight dwellers to the wasteland, so I just basically sent them all. What's interesting is they were only here for three minutes. And they, some of them had 25 caps. So I'm wondering, is that a legitimate tactic to have like 10 wastelanders you continuously send out, you know? Uh, you were down there, weren't you? Alright, let's see, collect that. One by one, here we go, guys. So what was your job? How were your intelligence uh, dweller? So you can hop into the lab. What about you, Dinkleberg? Dinkleberg is agility based. Dinkleberg, can you help it anywhere uh, huh. agility plus one but I can't do one on there I will whack him in the right away lab for now I mean he's not really useful there but at the same time it's better than nothing we'll take Todd Fisher here Todd welcome back again another 25 Samantha heal she was in there as well. See, a lot of these guys came back with 25 caps despite only being out for, you know, oops, I'm just realizing my, my capture program is a little bit off. I am screen capping this for my uh, iPhone guys, so apologies. Uh, people ask me what am I using to record. I am, uh, I'm using Reflector, which is a program which you stream once on your phone to your computer so I'm doing that uh, I'll do that Dan K memes can go down there now is this James it is look at that man his intelligence is off the hook Wow James get you into my lab I don't think there's anything I want there from her James is already delighted to be here of course and guys, I am playing on an iPhone 6. I get people asking me, like, how do I fix my iPad 2 crashing? I don't know. The game really crashes for me. So, his is mostly P, so we can go down there as well. Look at that, 90%. Holy smokes. Wow, that feel. That's crazy. I'm currently saving up a little bit for, uh... For an expansion here. Yeah, I wanna combine... Oh gosh, this is not good. So we have... I'm saving up to... Upgrade this and merge these two together. Let me just check my dailies. So I'm gonna get that one down the bottom. This one up top will be easy. But that raise any special stat of 15 dwellers is gonna take forever. You get the option to actually like remove one, but not for a while. I have so many more people. No, I. Elder lions, Danke memes. There's so many kids in here now. Let's go see the explorers and how they're doing. Okay, I was just making sure that wasn't spreading. 
Please returning. Elder Lion still being a beast with that 3k. Yeah, he is nine right. I might leave him overnight as well. I think he may be able to survive overnight. Murray Scott has lots of stuff. Emma Campbell with that lab coat is pretty good. And that's pretty good as well. This is that. Okay. How much is it to upgrade that? Wow, quite a lot. Another 1,000 to go. Let's check my inventory here. I could give that to someone in a water factory. Alright. She has no armor, so that'll benefit her. Looking pretty good, though. Looking pretty good. Uh, just need 800. I wonder if I could rush a few of these. I really see no reason not to. That's a joke. That's twice in a row. I had 70 to 80 percent chance of victory, and then I lost. Look, I have uh, I have this guy in it, Vincent Hicks, and then I also have. GM's now with the expert lab coat. Thing is, GM's expert lab coat doesn't benefit him. It's plus seven. Have we got anything with like plus one or two? Yeah, look, look at that. If I switch because it maxes out at nine, right? So if I switch that with a lab coat, it's still the same. And then we just do that, and she's up top now. That's crazy, that lab coat, dude. Even that, though. Even that would do. You know, because he's already on that, so if he does that, he's already up top. Oh, man, that's such a beastly room. Such a beastly room, bruh. So this is the best part, because when you get the later game, every time someone levels up, you get the amount of coins equal to their experience. So, look, I'll get 11 coins here. And so when you have like a hundred a hundred dwellers almost, you know, they're 20, 30 of them level and up, 20, 20, you know, level 20s, level 30s. So you're getting a couple hundred coins every time they level up, which is really nice. Some more radaways for me there. I actually want to get this radio tower upgraded today, so hopefully you guys can see that. Good thing. It's a, actually a good tip to do it right after something. Uh, you know, something give you off something. So as you saw there, my power station gave me power. You want to rush right after that because the actual time of it doesn't change after or before rushes. So you may as well wait and get the safe one out. I need 300 now. 23 percent. Come on. I'm a, I'm not a betting man, but those are pretty good odds, right? See, that's, that, look at the bottom, that's 10 seconds to go. So instead of actually just uh, doing it and, you know, feeling how about I wait, and then I do it directly after it. So, there's one. Now we'll rush. I guess a success. Great success! And then sometimes you'll actually get some extra coins, 200 or 300 coins, depends on how high your luck side is in that room, so just be aware. I'm training a lot of my guys in luck over here. Even the even the people who are crab luck, you know, because if you have a good luck stat, it's always going to increase the RNG events. So now we have that, I can actually finally upgrade this radio station. Oh yeah, got a full record store in here as well. Level of sixteen dollars, that's easy enough. Two hours to go, but need some people with high. Charisma. So let me just go to here. Actually, who's on a coffee break? So you can see, Rose Lyons has a pretty good charisma anyway. So we can take her down here to the radio room. I have some nightwear to put on her as well, so there you go. Who else is on a coffee break? The best charisma style of those two is Dylan Turner. So we take Dylan Turner and whack him in there.
Sweet. And I think that's it. That's gonna be an R and 50 bat, but that has more chance. So that's fully upgraded now. Oops. Yeah, that's fully upgraded. That's pretty good. These guys are gonna work together and level up a little bit more. Actually, they don't level up, but still, that's gonna increase my chances of gaining dwellers outside, so. I'm gonna send it here. Uh, next episode. Don't turn around, are you? Dylan, I told you to freaking. Down here? Who's the person that took your place? Alexander Martin, you're a P. Get up a P. It's all about rearranging where you can. Who's gonna leave now that I put him in there? Should be interested. Was it her? See, her special is. Nothing. She's pretty bad, actually. So hard, but that helps because we have extra room in there. We might as well just have the extra one point in there instead of having her wander around doing nothing. So it's looking pretty good, guys. Honestly, it really is. Um, I guess I'll show you what I've unlocked. So I've got the water purification. I'm going to move into that next. This Nuka Cola bottler actually requires endurance. So I actually have a little endurance rig down here. I'm training a couple people in endurance, getting up to threes and fours. Because the Nuka Cola bottler really needs that. So we'll get that next episode. But for now, I think that's pretty much it. I think we're all good. So that's my, my vault so far. 35 uh, stim packs. Well, 41 now, right? Now I can only hold 35 because my med bed. I need to get more. So yes. I'll catch you guys later. And yeah. Any tips, let me know. Bye-bye.